So the liver is a complex organ. It has a lot of functions. Patients with non-alcoholic fatty liver disease benefit from the Mayo Care because we offer the best technologies in a timely fashion. The non-alcoholic part of that is actually very important because obviously there's an alcoholic version of fatty liver disease and a lot of people all think every liver disease is alcohol related and it is very, very wrong. NAFL stands for non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. It really is an umbrella term for a continuum of diseases. And when we see additional features of inflammation and injury in the liver, we refer to that as non-alcoholic steatohepatitis, which is a mouthful, so just NASH. Impact of NASH is, is huge, actually, and it, it's not only growing in prevalence, but I think it's also being recognized more. There's more obesity, diabetes, metabolic syndrome that lead to NASH. Approximately 40% of the U.S. population um, is obese, and fatty liver disease is a problem that comes in, in conjunction with this excess weight. How we diagnose non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, really the gold standard has been a liver biopsy. However, liver biopsy is invasive, and Mayo has really been a pioneer in the development of a, a technique called magnetic resonance elastography, or let's call it MRE for short, which helps us quantify or measure the amount of scarring or stiffness there is in the liver. The good news is that if the disease is caught earlier, the disease is reversible because the liver is a forgiving organ. If you can get the fat and the inflammation out of the liver, you could potentially at least delay progression. You might be able to have regression. We make a personalized treatment plan. The plan starts with visiting with a nutritionist to discuss about what are the best ways to change the way they eat in order to lose weight. We're trying to think long-term, and we need to be aggressive in managing all the issues.